not peace at the expense of freedom, but both peace and freedom here in this hemisphere. October the 4th, 1957, while the Americans were still finalizing their plans, opened, the springs snapped, and the nose cone was... Derrubado o muro de Berlim, desculpe. Pois em junho de 1989, depois de uma cimeira com Helmut Kohl. Can I walk to the Belvedere Hotel from here? Communicate with one another globally, posting YouTube videos and protecting your email against viruses. Read me that text. Do you think it will snow today? We are, we are the pioneers to start that business. We, we are one of the big factories in Monza right now. Uh, we employ around 1,000 people, in a directly and indirectly 1,000 people. And uh, it's a Why are you guys so anti-dictators? Imagine if America was a dictatorship. You could let 1% of the people have all the nation's wealth. You could help your rich friends get richer by cutting their taxes and bailing them out when they gamble and lose. You could ignore the needs of the poor for healthcare and education. Your media would appear free, but would secretly be controlled by one person and his family. You could wiretap phones. You could torture foreign prisoners. You could have rigged elections. You could lie about why you go to war. You could fill your prisons with one particular racial group and no one would complain. You could use the media to scare the people into supporting policies that are against their interests. I know this is hard for you Americans to imagine, but please try.